Appalachian Wireless is Appalachian Advantage. Unlimited text, talk, and two gigs of data for as low as $45 a month. Or if you like, get five lines on eight gigs of data for just $145 a month. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Last Friday, Governor Matt Bevin fired the latest salvo in the ongoing war of words with Kentucky's teachers. Bevin chided Kentucky Association of School Superintendents Executive Director Tom Shelton for an email he sent to school districts, outlining plans for demonstrations in Frankfurt in the event Bevin calls a special legislative session to approve a new teacher retirement plan. In the letter, Shelton says schools will be closed on the day educators go to Frankfurt to protest. This is where it gets interesting. We would be asking superintendents to dismiss schools and send employees and other constituents to Frankfurt on their assigned days, and for everyone to attend as possible the corresponding day of the march slash rally. But while Shelton's email riled Bevan, the plans to protest appear to be moving forward. If a special session is announced, one or more of Kentucky's eight educational cooperatives will demonstrate at the Capitol on a particular day of the session. The Kentucky Valley Educational Cooperative will tentatively demonstrate on day four of the session. Jason Griffith, the teacher in the Letcher County School System, said he's ready to protest, but he hopes he doesn't have to. We don't want it to get to special session. That's our goal. This doesn't need to go to special session. We believe that when a special session is called, then the governor will have the votes, and we don't want it to get to that point. So uh, we, ha we have to stop this before it happens. Griffith, not speaking on behalf of Letcher County Schools, said Bevin's plan, coupled with previously announced plan budget cuts, will hurt the school district. Like other school districts in eastern Kentucky, Griffith said Letcher County Schools will have trouble recruiting teachers under the new plan. He hopes another solution, one that properly funds the pension, is found. Folks that are on the bubble about retiring are going to retire, and I've, I've already spoken to five that are going to retire. You know, if you have fewer people, uh, you know, it, it, it's still a problem because then the, uh, a larger problem is we have larger class sizes, you know, and and kids can't learn in a classroom with 40 people in it. It just doesn't work like that. Uh, all the math shows and all the research shows that kids in smaller classes learn better. It's a, really an attack on education. It's an attack on teachers and state employees. I mean, no matter how you look at it, it's what it is. A special legislative session is estimated to cost Kentucky taxpayers about $65,000 per day. In Letcher County, Chris Anderson, EKB News.